Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are learning how to identify an authentic Chanel classic double flap and spot a fake one. In a previous video we learned already how to spot a fake lady or purse and after searching a lot I found this fake Chanel purse and I decided to make this video for you. It was not easy to tell you the truth to find this bag but <clears throat> Um, I've heard a lot at that time that um, there is so many fakes um, Chanel that are so good that nobody can identify them and blah 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 but of course there is a way and uh, now we will talk about it because it's very very important um, there are some uh, important things that which you have to look on to uh, see the difference of course, this um, bag that I have now, it's not a new one, the fake, uh, and it looks already not so good um, as uh, it could look before, but uh, some of the um, important um, things will help you. Anyway, it's uh, you will see the bag itself, you will understand. Um, uh, the stamping, uh, the leather quality and uh, many other things, the chain which is very important. So let's start. Uh, here we have um, two dust bags because I'm usually starting with a dust bag because it's also very important to see the dust bag. Uh, so uh, look at this dust bag. I'm sure uh, that now many of you think that on our left side we have uh, an authentic Chanel and on our right side we have a fake one but it's not the case so on the left side we will have a fake this is how looks the fake dust bag so uh, now um, it's quite good um, quite um, uh, well made uh, dust bag but if you will look more close, you will see that um, the printing here, if you will touch it, um, you will um, immediately feel that it's, it has a structure. Uh, so it, you will feel the coloring. It's very important. On original white Chanel dust bag, um, you will not feel anything. It's completely soft and flat, so you will not feel um, any type of color in it. Here, if you uh, touch it with your hand, it's just um, pieces of color. So if you will uh, scrap them, you will uh, pr probably uh, get a possibility to take it out. So. Um, but it's quite well done because um, you, see, you see here that you, you see the stitches and uh, it's quite good for me, it looks nice. Anyway, this is authentic Chanel and you see that even on this old dust bag there is no, um, there is no um, pieces of color, it's completely flat so it's very um, good done. Um, here you can open it. So let's open. So and this is how they both look. Um, okay, so let's start. And the first is of course the complete appearance of the bag. If you hold them together you will immediately understand the difference. So if you um, have it in your hand you will of course uh, if you have this in in your um, in your hand you will immediately uh, immediately understand that it's a fake one when you compare it to authentic one but some people they don't have a possibility um, to see the authentic one because they are living far from Chanel store or um, they cannot go um, there for any other reasons so it's difficult. I understand that it's very difficult to um, to have um, an opinion only on the pictures. So here you can immediately see the difference of the leather. The leather on authentic Chanel it's very 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 puffy. You see how um, the structure of the leather, how different is it? 
it's not flat it's um it shines and it uh, has um like when you um when you hold it you will um feel it the puffiness the puffiness of the leather it's very different if you compare it with a fake one so um let's take a fake one and to see it more close so you see that this uh rumps um they are completely different so um the second and the very important thing is the lock the lock of authentic chanel Wait, i will try to show it closer to you this is the lock of authentic chanel so um the cc is more fine and more uh, and thinner and the fake one is thicker and have angles in the middle now i will try to show it to you one and look at the boss CC so you see the fake one is thicker and it's quite bigger the whole C and the thickness of uh, the C itself it's 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 like more thick and you see how it's made it's very different so this is the main uh, one of the main things as well. The other thing which is also very important and which you can uh, immediately spot on the pictures is these rings. The rings on Authentic Chanel where the chain comes from they are very flat. They are not rounded, they don't ha you, um, they are completely flat on the leather, on the same level as the leather is. So, you see, they are very flat. On a fake one, it's usually rounded. You see this? Um, on the lock, the uh, next uh, important thing on the lock is the noise when you open an authentic CC it doesn't have any noise listen here and this is how the fake opens So it's I'm trying to give you um, more um, understanding but um, I think that in a fake uh, bag the lock um, is made with a completely different system it's like uh, on authentic bag it's when you close it, the hardware is um, very high quality and just close and open it and um, there is no spiral inside, but here we have a spiral in a, in a fake one. So let's open the bags. Um, the screws on authentic Chanel here. they are flat this two screw they are flat they don't have um, any structure and on a fake one the screws are usually rounded it's not um, all the time maybe now they have a new one but you see also the stamp the writing of Chanel is very different. If you will um, compare it to each other, this one, uh, the fake one, also was a um, before it was a gold hardware. But um, after uh, one year of fairing, you see this um, here is gone and it's not nice anymore. 
so it's not an investment. Also, Chanel bag, it's an investment. If you will uh, see the prices uh, before, how much it was cost uh, in 2006 and how much it costs now, <laughs> it's very big difference. So, um, those who bought it in 2006 and in the, if they will sell it now, they will uh, get much more than they have spent uh, before. Um, so, you get uh, a lot of... Uh, a lot of positive things in it so you can wear your bag you can make money in the same time you can be stylish and many many other um, positive things so um, the next uh, what I want to tell you uh, and it's also very important maybe some fakes they are different but you have also to look on this this is very important so I will show it to you now so you will understand it. Um, so look at this uh, stamp, Chanel made in Italy. And now look at this uh, small um, small lock, yeah, the piece of the lock. If you will put your pen here, um, the this small button, it will be exactly in the middle. So I'm, maybe I'm not holding it straight exactly, but you can see it will be exactly in the middle. If we are taking a fake one, and uh, uh, also the, the printing is also very different. If you have a trained eye, you will also understand it. So um, you see where the um, the middle of the pan comes in. So it's ex uh, not same place. It's not straight. Uh, it's actually on the end. This small uh, thing will also help you to um, understand uh, this. Um, the very important thing also this CC how they are. Um, done how they are stitched also the leather quality is different this is the authentic one this the fake one and also this small button is not placed placed very properly actually all the bag is um, destroyed uh, the fake bag so you see the quality of stitching on authentic Chanel. This all moments are very important and this is the fake stitching. Also the color of uh, um, leather inside is different. Of course you have mentioned it already I think. So be very careful today. It's. Uh, um, very um, good fakes are available on the market. Sometimes I'm also looking in Instagram or somewhere how many fake they have and how um, good are they on the pictures. Um, so here I want to show you again how different is it that you will be more careful the color of lining how different is it and also the stamping these are two bags, the stamping of this and the stamp on this. Also the color of the stamp itself, it's different. Also the next and very, very important is the chain. Oh, the chain, it's so ugly. <laughs> uh, this um, is uh, the fake chain and um, if you were taking the piece of leather from it it's very very thin you see the quality of this leather oh. and this is the authentic chain you see how different and well made is it also after the years it will be not damaged the color will not go out this bag is already one year, I think. Authentic. So this is uh, on the, my right side is authentic piece of leather. It's very thick, and um, it's well stitched. It's very good quality, lambskin. And uh, this is 
the fake one you immediately see the difference I think on the video also the chain quality very different if you hold it like this we'll try to show you better it's different the angles of authentic chain I look much more fine polished yeah of course so the other thing is uh, internal sticker on a fake bag it's usually placed or could be placed wrongly so you see where where it is and how it looks it looks completely different from authentic one the internal sticker is a very very important thing in identifying um, authentic um, authentic um, Chanel bag so look on it very properly look at this um, numbers they are not done in a same um, in the same style of Chanel uh, and it's very easily um, uh, it could be taken off and uh, this um, um, the paper thing it placed on the um, um, on a plastic on the top but in authentic one it is under in authentic one it's also shiny um, and it should be placed exactly in the left corner so it should be placed here inside of the back so it's more down in the um, in the place of uh, the stitches here down on the left corner uh, other thing is the card um, the card, uh, un unfortunately I cannot show you the number, the complete number on the card, but the very important thing is also how the card looks. It's not shiny, it, uh, it's just a plastic card and uh, it's a little bit um, printed in. This gold um, thing, it's a little bit uh, printed in, so you, you can feel it. Uh, the numbers also are printed printed inside. Uh, it's not uh, on the top. It doesn't have any shine at all. So if you will see the shiny um, card with hologram or something, it's not authentic back. Also, if you will see any kind of uh, shoes which are coming with a authenticity card, it's also fake shoes. Uh, Chanel does not produce. Um, any cards for the shoes never and it has never um, as I know it has been never produced for the shoe the, the uh, authenticity cards are coming only with leather goods um, with accessories not uh, with the shoes um, so this is how the authentic Chanel internal sticker looks like so you see it's a bit shiny, the letter, uh, the um, numbers have its specific right, uh, writing and it has, oh I can not fix my camera very well, it has two lines on it. So it's very important to take a look on the sticker, on the number, because it can tell you a lot about the bag. So I just um, did it with my other bag with the mini because it was easier for me to show you how it looks. Thanks. One of uh, also very important things is the sides of the bag. Uh, if you will see. Uh, the side of um, authentic bag they are more fine here it's flat and uh, 
here it has small wave so but here if you will look it's completely damaged it's not looking they're not um, uh, not nicely made immediately you can see that something is not good with this bag so if you have any kind of um, feeling that this bag um, is not so perfect as it should be as the Chanel bag should be don't buy never buy because it's so many good fakes super fakes now and you can be you could be easily um, um, fraud it so it's not good um, to buy it um, on eBay like an auction or um, in any other place which is not um, certified at, like uh, their um, like Yugi's closet or um, the stair collective um, like this website they are very good um, they are checking everything very properly before ship it to you. Of course, you will pay a little bit more um, because they they are taking high, high commissions. But you w you could be sure that you are having an authentic Chanel and it's really real bag. It's not um, super faked or um, there is no some. Um, hidden things in it so it's completely perfect back as described because they are also also checking um, the condition of the bag the year of production and many other things so um, I hope you like my video and I hope it will help you um, if you have any questions you can usually ask me or if you want to um, if you want if you need any help for identifying the bag or um, you want um, any help to understand the year of production of the bag or something else you have any questions about Chanel about shoes um, any kind of ident uh, identification you can usually uh, write an email to me I will um, um, uh, you will find my email address under um, the video I will put it there and uh, I, I'm open for um, for any of your questions so feel free to contact me and if you are interested uh, in um, a video for Chanel boy I also can make it for you if you have an interest just uh, comment on my video and I will definitely do it one day just I need to find <laughs> a fake bag for this video but I will try to um, to find it and uh, also if you need any other uh, kind of video for uh, showing um, bags like uh, authentic and fake to see the differences to know um, just let me know comment on my video and I will definitely do it for you thanks for watching keep uh, subscribing to my channel and have a nice day for everybody bye